Hi you guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm filming a little spring haul. Alright, so I don't know where to start, you guys. I have gotten so much stuff. Um, I'm overwhelmed. Okay. Well, let's start with Forever 21 first because it's the most stuff, I feel. So this is the bag, and I'll just show you what I got. Alright, so the first thing that I picked up here was this really cute, it kind of reminds me of that Aritzia dupe top, um, but I got it in this really pretty like burnt orange color, it's just so beautiful, I think it's so perfect for the spring and summertime, it looks great on my skin tone, and I just love it, I love that it's a really cute ribbed crop halter top, and the quality, you guys, is amazing for Forever 21, if I must say, like it feels so good, you guys, like it looks so good, I wish you guys can see like it in person, but it literally looks amazing. And I love it. I got this in a size small. The next thing that I got from Forever 21 was this really pretty cross necklace. And it has rhinestones on it, so it kind of gives that little bling look of a necklace. And I love it so much. And I actually don't own a cross necklace, and it was just time to get one, you know what I mean? Like, I love my zodiac signs, but I love this one as well. It's so pretty, and it's this really pretty gold color. So I love that. And then I got some new rings. So these rings are gold, and they look like this. I love them a lot. I probably only wear like three out of them, but they're so cute, you guys. Like, I love them. I think these two look really good. And yeah. Um, I'm excited. Alright, the next store that I went into was HM. So I'm just gonna show you everything I got from there. So I just picked up these trousers, and these are my first pair of trousers, you guys, and I'm so excited to create my neutral collection in trousers. Um, it's taken me a very long time to find pieces like this because I'm very specific on how I want things to look and feel and things like that. And if it fits, it fits, and I'll get it. But if not, I'll just keep waiting until something better comes along. That's how I am with my clothes. It's taken me a lot to build my wardrobe and find these pieces, even though you guys can see that they're from like H&M and Forever 21, and they're just so easy to find on things like that. But to me, it's more personal. But look at how pretty they are, you guys. Like, look at how cute they are. They go all the way down, and they're pretty long. Um, they have pockets, I love that. I wanted it to look more like loose fitting, but more structured to where it's like this kind of look and feel. Um, it has false back pockets. Yeah, they're just so cute, you guys. I love the little pleated look in the front. I love how it has pockets. It looks more like structured. It looks more nice, if that makes sense. Um, I got this in a size four, and I can't wait to sell this for you guys. All right, next up we have Urban Outfitters. Let's just do a little. I'm trying to get a thumbnail on every like thing because I feel like sometimes I forget. All right, so the first thing that I got from Urban was this really cute top. And it's gonna be like a bedtime or like loungewear top, but I love it. It's literally just a plain shirt and it says oat milk on it. And you guys know that I'm obsessed with oat milk. I have been for the past few months and I'm really into it. It's just, it's so good, you guys. And I love that this shirt is like a nice oatmeal color. It's just so cute, you guys. And I can't wait to wear this like to bed, like hot girl walks, like all that good stuff. So I'm excited. And this is in a size small. They also have this in a black color, but I couldn't decide between the black color and this color. And I didn't want to get two of the same things because I felt like that just didn't make sense. So I just got this one. I feel like every time I get on camera to film, I've always just had a coffee and the caffeine is like really hitting me hard. Um, but I'm fine, you guys. So the next thing I got is this cropped top from Urban, and it's so cute, you guys. It's this really pretty ivory color, and I love the detailing of, like, the lining and, like, the stitching and just, like, the false buttons. Like, it's just so cute, and I love the cut of it. And I styled this with sweatpants on, and I love how it looks, so I'm going to keep this for sure. And this is a medium large. Yeah, it's so pretty, you guys. Just a great staple, a great basic as well, just to switch it up. Alright, the next thing that I got from Urban Outfitters is this green hat, and it's Yankees, I think this is a Yankees hat. Please don't come for me with sports, I'm really not good with that in teams. But I think it is the, like the New York Yankees, are they from New York? I don't know, but um, I got this really pretty green hat, and I'm so excited to wear this, and I have a few green pieces in my wardrobe already, so it's just perfect. I love it. 
it's really good like street style wear minimalist like just chill bad hair day you know what i mean it's just perfect and then i also got another hat this one is in black and it says la um i'm obsessed um it says 47 here i don't know what that means but it says 47 um and it's so cute you guys i love it and also just black is like another classic staple you know what i mean just if i don't want the pop of green color i had to get black as well the last store that i went to was zara so i'm just going to show you everything i got i hope this like these shots weren't too close up all right let's start with the basics so the first thing i got was this black shirt and it's just a plain black cotton t-shirt and i don't have this in my wardrobe so i had to get it and it's just like just to throw on like every day like i can wear this with that la hat and like some jeans and a bag and it'll look cute together you know what i mean just a simple like effortless basic staple outfit all right you guys and the next thing that i have here is a black crop top from zara this is in a size small um again just a cute cropped basic with like some denim shorts and some sneakers and like a white flannel over maybe or something just like just the basic you guys i can wear this any season at any time even for bedtime wear so i love that all right and then you guys know i love my neutral so i had to get everything in white so i have this white cotton t-shirt and it's in a medium and it's just great i haven't worn any of these pieces yet but i'm excited to wear them like every day and yeah you guys and then i got a white crop top from zara and again i don't have these pieces in my wardrobe so i had to incorporate them in um and i can't wait to sell these with like sweats um shorts like skirts like literally any and everything skirts like i'm excited for that all right you guys and the last thing i may have here is this very pretty top um she is gorgeous i love her so much and she was the last small luckily she fit me very well and very nice and yeah she's just beautiful you guys i cannot wait to style this i actually can't wait to wear this somewhere like i can see this like a nice daytime brunch or like i don't know by the boardwalk or like picnic park i don't know she's so beautiful and then also like street style like some cute mom jeans and some heels and a bag you know just to dress her up in like some shades and nice jewelry i think that looks so pretty and yeah now I'm showing you everything I got from Ulta. Alright, so I've got some skincare stuff because I feel like it's time for me to buy new skincare items because the ones I have, I got them in like January and I stopped using them because I felt like maybe it did, I wasn't doing it long enough and also maybe my skin was just getting used to it. So I decided it was time for new skincare. Um, so I got Good Molecules, the brightening toner, and I've been using this daily, you guys. Like when I tell you this is my new ritual, like coming home washing my face putting on this toner doing my skincare stuff waking up in the morning washing my face you know what i mean like it's just been such a routine for me and i love it you literally just shake the bottle and then you just put it on clean skin and you can use cotton pads but i actually forgot to pick them up so i've just been using my hands um so that's fine does it have a smell i don't think it has a smell i'm not sure It does not have a smell, you guys, which is amazing if you're, like, sensitive to fragrances or you're, you know, it's just, it's not scented, which is nice. It's not even, like, lightly scented. It kind of just smells like nothing to me. The last item I have from Ulta is Good Molecules Discoloration Coloring Serum. Um, now, I was recommended these products by the work at Sephora, but I've also been doing my research on TikTok a few months ago on, like, this brand, but I just never went into purchase anything or, like, you know, get started with it. So... I got the serum as well, and I use it daily. Um, does it smell like anything? Okay, this one smells scented. It's like a light, maybe cherry scent. I don't know. I can't explain the smell, but it smells good. It's a very light scent. It's not like overpowering. It's not something that's like strong like chemical smell or anything like that. Um, it's really good. My skin has been liking it. I feel like. For the first few days that I started using this, I feel like I got little tiny bumps, but also I wasn't drinking enough water those few days, so it could have been like dehydration or like something like that, or maybe just my skin reacting to a new product on my face, because it literally has been doing the same skincare stuff routine for a while now. 
But um, yeah, so like the first few days I had it, my skin did have little tiny bumps on it. And they went away. Like it's nothing that you have to put like a pimple patch on or anything like that. It was literally, maybe it was heat bumps as well. It could have been heat bumps because it's been very hot here lately. Um, so yeah. But other than that, literally no reaction to my skin. No like itchy, no burning sensation, no cooling sensation, nothing. It just kind of feels like regular skincare um, products. So I love that for me. Um, and yeah, I'll keep you guys updated on my skin. I'm going to give it a full two weeks before I even decide to judge um, if it has cleared my marks or anything like that with my skin. But the texture of my skin is still the same pretty much. Um, but when I use these products, it definitely does give me a nice brightening like sheen to it. Um, and yeah, and then I go in with the moisturizer. I just go in with my um, Laneige Water Bank. I think the moisturizing cream that they have and yeah that's little that's my new like routine right now so yeah i hope you guys all enjoyed this haul thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye <laughs>